Hi everyone, uh, in this video let's see how to do the save edit in uh, Euro Truck Simulator 2. So we will discuss uh, multiple options here. Uh, the first one is uh, how to change uh, profile name in Euro Truck Simulator 2. The second will be to change uh, certain parameters like your money in your account or even the uh, your experience levels just by using notepad or a text editor. And the third option, uh, we will see how to do all these editings using the TS Save Editor tool. Now, if you're planning to do the third option, then the second is already included. You don't have to do that. But if you don't want to use any tool, you can check for first and second. So if you look into ETS2 uh, and uh, go to maybe edit a profile, you can see you cannot change the uh, your profile name. You can only change the company name and then the other parameters. So we will first see how can you change this right if let's say you have downloaded a profile from outside and you want to uh, change the name how do you do it so first thing you want to do is uh, quit euro truck simulator 2 go to your documents and euro truck simulator 2 folder and here you will see a file called config.cfg Open that with a text editor, notepad or any other text editor and search for save format. Save underscore format, which by default will be zero. Now this saves all the SII and other files in an encrypted format. So you need to make it to two, which will make it a, a decryptable format. So the first thing you need to change is change the G underscore save underscore format to two. Then save the game save this file and then launch the game and uh, because already the files are saved in a different format once you launch the game and exit all these files will be resaved with the new format for the changes that we have made so after you made that change you log into the game and then uh, quit the game once again so that all the remaining files will be saved with the new format okay once you're here you can exit the game so for now uh, you can see i have 2000 xp i my skills are only this much and uh, my money in the account is 50000 i'll anyway exit the, this you can keep in mind because we are going to edit these later so i'll quit the game and by the time you quit the game all these files will be updated in the new format now what you need to do is you need to download a file called SII decrypt uh, I'll put the link in the description you can download this file I've downloaded it and uh, kept it in my desktop it's an exe file now uh, you need to go to your profiles now you can see multiple folders here each folder corresponds to each profile so I only have one profile that's why there is one folder so each folder here corresponds to each profile you have now to change the profile name you need to change two things one this folder name and the second is the actual profile name inside so we'll do the we'll change the profile name first go inside and you can see there's a file called profile.sii if you double click and try to open it it will be in an encrypted uh, a garbage format so uh, what you need to do is just drag it and drop it on top of the sii decrypt it will open a pop-up window and close it automatically it was fast that's why you didn't see it once it is done that means this application have decrypted this file you can open it again and it will be in a readable format now if you go to the bottom end you can see this is my profile name ets2 indian modes so let's say i want to change it as a uh, new profile or something or maybe uh, yeah new profile so once I change it here, what you need to do is copy this and then go to this uh, page. So there is a string to hex conversion page. So I'll leave this link also in the description. You paste it here. What this does is that will generate the equivalent hex code of this file, this name, this string. So this is the hex code of this truck, this uh, text. Similarly, they have a hex to string converter. So if you, uh, so I'll save this file. If you go back to your profiles list, if you take this folder's name, 
copy it and put it into the hex to string converter if you put it here you will understand this is the hex code of your previous profile name so i will take the new name put it in the string to hex converter copy this uh, hex code and rename this folder with that so there is two things you need to change one is you change the name in the profile.sii second you change the folder name with the hex code of the profile name if either of this doesn't match the profile will not be shown in your uh, uh, game that's why it is better you take a copy of it before maybe take make a copy of this folder uh, to somewhere else and then make the changes so make sure to do the same changes here profile.sii and here after this if you launch the game you can see it have changed our profile name remaining everything else you can change from here you can change your image truck design logo the company name and everything here but the profile name you cannot change from here yes that's why we have we have discussed this option now i have uh, exited the game next thing we will discuss is how to change your xp and money with only text editors so you go to your profile and uh, go to save so understand one thing if you are not changing the profile name you are only changing this still you will have to make that change in config.cfg config.cfg file in the same format and then launch the game and quit it okay so you go to profile you go to the whichever profile you want to change and you click on save this will be the different saves you have so this will be the latest auto save this and remaining auto saves will be here as auto save underscore something and this is a manual save so you know in the game i can save the game manually so the manual saves will be written as one two three four like that auto save the latest auto save will be this so uh, if you want to edit a particular manual save you can uh, take that or i'll edit the latest auto save that's why this folder i'll pick inside that you can see there is a file called game.sii as we discussed before it will be in a unreadable format so uh, as like we did before drag this sii file and put it on top of the sii decrypt now you can uh, it will be in an editable format so the first thing you need to search in this is uh, search for money so it's m o n e y in sorry okay, sorry search for uh, money in account so it's m o n e y underscore account so uh, i've shown you before that we only had 50000 in our in my account so i'll make it uh, maybe uh, 50 lakhs 50 lakhs you can make it anything i think uh, the maximum allowed is uh, 13 times 9 that is 9 uh, digit uh, 13 times anyway uh, this will change the money in your account you can make it as big as you want the next thing you want to change is experience now uh, there will be multiple uh, it is experience points there will be multiple experience points because you might have uh, ai drivers and they will all be below this that's why what you can do is change the direction to up because it comes on top of the money change the direction to up and then search find this is bus experience not that one this is the experience point so i have shown you before i had 2000 you can make it to any you want maybe i'll make 20000 or 2 lakh something like that now these are the different uh, uh, skills you have so you know there is an adr with uh, six uh, different skills long distance skills heavy skills and all with six points for each now the maximum for all these are six so you can make it anything between 0 uh, to 6 so 6 will make you like a completely skilled this is the uh, first adr skills that the maximum you will have to make it as 6 3 three will put all as uh, skilled now once you do this uh, you can uh, close it and save this file now launch the game
I'll continue the game. Now here you can immediately see and the 5000 I've made became a 5 lakh. My XP have increased. Previously if you look at my skills, previously it were like only 1 and 2 uh, scored but now it's all 6. So th these are the ADR, long distance, all those skills. ADR the maximum to get all 6 you need to type in 63 and the remaining all 0 to 6 whichever as depending on the numbers you want. So the money also increased and uh, everything increased. Now if you've edited any different save what you can do is you can click on save and load and load whichever save you've edited. Let's say I've edited that uh, folder named one that will be this manual save either I can load that or I can load any auto save whichever I've edited. Now I think you understood this uh, procedure. So until now we were discussing to edit the uh, profile parameters using notepad only. Now we'll go to a new uh, method which is using a tool or a software called TS Save Editor. So I'll leave the link in the description. Uh, you can download this tool. Uh, you can uh, click here and it will download the latest one. Once you download, uh, I have it downloaded here, TS Save Edit Tool. It will be coming as a uh, zip file. You need to extract it into a folder and from there you will see something called TSSC Tool.exe. So double click that to run. It will automatically che check for updates. Okay. Now, uh, so here you can see you need to make sure whether you are running ETS2 or ATS. So if you are running ATS, you need to click on ATS, otherwise uh, we are already in ATS. Now this is L means actually the local profiles, okay. They are by default looking into my folder documents and Euro Truck Simulator 2. If let's say uh, you have Steam profiles, you will it will show here S profiles or something like that. S, S is Steam and C is custom. Custom means let's say in the previous video we have discussed how you can change the uh, default documents path. Let's say you have the documents in a different path or your Euro Truck Simulator 2 folder in a different path. You can add the custom folder, choose the folder and find the folder until Euro Truck Simulator 2 and set it so that it will show here as custom path 1 or custom path 2, you can select that. So I'll put it in the local profile folder only and you know our profile folder name is new profiles, right? We just changed it. If you have multiple profiles that will show here. So whichever profile you want to edit, you can click that. And this is which save you need to edit. As you have seen, I have a latest auto save, a previous drive auto save and a manual save. We will change the latest auto save itself. Now, once you selected all this, just press load. Now it will load all the parameters. Now you can see uh, if you only had lesser skills, it will be like something like this. So you can put it to the maximum. You can uh, change all this. Uh, you can inc This is the uh, player level, experience level. You can increase it to uh, increase like this by 10 or Y1 like this. You can increase to any level you want. Go to company. Here is the money you have. You remember we made our 5000 into 5 lakhs let's say i want to make add uh, like uh, two more zeros and maybe or maybe i'll make it uh, 5 lakh 55555 right uh, you can make it as high as you want okay as much money you want uh, then um, these are the uh, visited cities so you can see i visited few cities so whatever you are seeing as uh, this yellow color are visited so let's say it will be hard to visit all the cities. So what you can do is you can click a particular city and say click visit so that it will also be like visited. So that uh, city will be highlighted in your map as like it is visited and you can do the jobs uh, from and to that city directly. If you want to visit all, you can just click visit without selecting any and that will visit make every cities as visit. Similarly, these are the garages. You can see these uh, red and orange are the garages I own. This is large one, this is small one. 
So let's say I want to make this uh, bigger, I can upgrade it to a large one. I want to buy this garage, I can just buy it and again upgrade it. If you want to buy all, just press buy uh, and then upgrade without selecting any. Now you own all the garages and all of them are the large size. Now you can even sell the garages or downgrade the garages. Again, you can uh, unvisit a city if you want. But uh, I would recommend not to go back because let's say you're selling a particular garage, you might have trucks uh, which are saved in that garage that might cause uh, some uh, uncertainty and that might cause the game to crash that's why i would say only go forward like visit more or buy more don't go backward because that i mean if you're going just make sure you don't have any other dependency now go to trucks this will list all the trucks you have so i have a lot of trucks uh, in that i have bought so this is the truck that i am driving that is why you're seeing the profile name here. The remaining all are uh, different drivers that I've assigned. Now uh, you can choose any truck you want. This is the fuel of the truck. If it is like less, you can just click this to make it 100%. These are the damages. If it's like less or your truck have already damages, you can click this so that it will fix all the damages without taking any money. There are additional options like you can, uh, let's say, copy the paint settings of uh, one truck then choose an another truck and then say paint the pace setting so the new truck will have the paint setting of the first truck that you have selected you can do all these things like that then there is trailers so if you own trailers you can select those trailers here and you can do these the like uh, damage fixes and everything then this is the fleet market so you can make custom jobs you can choose the source and destination and add those jobs here but I like the uh, stock jobs so I won't do anything and here and all convoy and cargo market I think he, he is uh, just keeping on updated uh, so maybe we'll uh, keep it uh, sorted for a later discussion if you want so these are the things you can change once you do all the changes just press save so the changes will be saved to this save of the game okay once it is done, uh, accept the application and uh, play Euro Truck Simulator 2. Right now you can see the money have changed, our experience points have changed, uh, my skills depending on whatever changes you want to make that would have changed. So whatever changes you have made those would have been uh, taken in effect. If you have uh, edited any different save what you can do is you can click on load and save and load a previously saved game. So let's say you have edited this or a different auto save you can load that game. So you can see you have a different amount of money in if you look into the map now you can see we have visited all the cities uh, all the cities are highlighted as like it is visited if you look at uh, garages uh, you can see we own all the garages here so uh, this is the ts save edit tool i hope uh, this video has been helpful guys uh, there are uh, more and more dimensions of save edit like uh, maybe truck uh, editing and all like if you want to make like a crossover kind of track with the lower side of Scania and upper side of uh, let's say man track or something like that you can do that with save edit so but it will be it will make this video too long so if you want uh, any of those uh, you can put it in the comments I can make another video mm -hmm. thank you so much guys uh, have a nice day